tear that up. I couldn't understand her. You wanna know why? Look at this car. What am I supposed to say, Sam? What am I supposed to say? I have enough. You've not been around. Sam, you don't understand. And the Oscar goes to... Hi, I'm Samuel. I'm almost 30 years old. I'm gonna be 30 years in five days from now. I'm coming from Florence, Italy, and I'm living in Singapore since the last five, the last five years. I have my personal training company, and I want to win this award 2020. Hi, I'm Wei I'm 26 years old this year, and I work as an IT consultant. I love to play a lot of computer games so much that the Steam record adds up to more than 13,000 hours. My mom wasn't very pleased with that, so that's why I decided to step out of the house, train up, and join Mr. World Singapore 2020. Hi, my name is Rabani. I'm 27 this year. I've been in the fitness industry for 10 years. Currently, I'm doing a freelance personal trainer. At the same time, during my free time on the weekend, I actually do Dragon Boat. I was uh, formerly from the national team itself and right now I'm in um, just a normal uh, PLK team in Dragon Boat. Uh, something interesting about me is that I do eat a lot of junk foods. However, I do not actually gain a lot of size. Hey everyone, my name is Mario. I am uh, 30 this year. I work as a certified personal trainer. Well, my passion is music. I self taught myself in guitar and piano. Um, I like to travel as well. So I'm someone who prefers scenery more than shopping. So my moral in life is that uh, if you want something, chase after it. Alright, do not give up. Hello, I'm Jeffrey Chong. I'm 26 years old and I'm the supervisor in F&B Outlet. In my free time, I like to play badminton and some of the martial arts. I've lived with this man all my life and never once, never once could he give me a hug. Could he look me in my eyes? Never once could he tell me he loved me. You don't know what it feels like to come home from work and see him lying down there, passed out on the floor. You never had to lie to your friends. When your friends ask you what our father did as a living, what was I supposed to say? What was I supposed to say, Sam? Come on, tell me. Our father is a goddamn drunk. Do you know I was the one who comes home every day just to clean up his puke and broken beer bottles. And you know what? Frankly, I do get the satisfaction of seeing him lying like a dead man on the floor. You wanna know why? Look at this car. You never had to take a punch from this man. And for three years, Three years of my life, I had to come up with excuses, my friends, about my bruises. Gosh. Three years. Do you know how I was like living with this guy for three years? 
Yeah, three years of shit. Well, I, I, but well, I, I did it. I finally had the courage to stop him. And now he can't hurt me. I'm happy he's dead, Sam. I am very happy. Then one night, in my mind, the strings. I could take no more. She ran into the kitchen and I followed her. On the way, I took a hammer and went close to her. She saw me and she asked me what I was doing. I told her I couldn't stand her anymore. She saw the hammer and she dared me. She dared me to hit her. I had enough! She laughed. She laughed! She dared me to hit her. And I hit her. Again! Again! And again! It was tough in the case of the lines, yeah. I didn't really memorize them well. And that was the challenge for me. Yeah, I, would, I would say Mario. Wow, okay. because I can feel his emotion. And in terms of his tonality, it was believable. I think I did this. Because <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't remember my lines. Yeah, so yeah, definitely I did the worst because right, the other contestants, they never retake. Yeah, I retook like a few times because I couldn't remember the lines. Yeah, I got stuck. Yeah, so I think I did the worst because I didn't even complete. Mm. I think I have a high chance. But after today, the world. <laughs> I'm excited for the world to see me. Do you think stress well? Not really. For me, how I cope is I tend to avoid. Yeah, I tend to run away. And it's a bit ironic because when I, whenever I run away, I feel more pain. And the problem, the problem doesn't go away, but I still run away. So I would say I'm not very good handling stress. Uh, it was okay. My first time, this was a bit new to me, but overall, I still managed to go through it. Jeffrey, yeah, I think he might be the weakest. Firstly, it's his way of articulating himself. I think he's a bit challenged in expressing himself. I can see it through the acting. Actually, to me, I've never done any. Um, acting before, so it was nervous, especially during the day one, because it's just not me. I have to do something that is not what I've been doing. I think today I did great, yeah, to myself, because I know I'm not a memorized kind of person. Very intense, feels suffocating. <laughs> Honestly, I never thought I'd go this far because I'm no way to be that kind of standard of Mr. World. So, but I'm a person who don't give up easily. Actually, my parents are divorcing this month. How does that make you feel? Uh, um, honestly, I feel sad, happy, sad because um, my mom will be working out to find a job and at her age, she's been a housewife for very long. So I worry about her health. As why I'm happy is that um, so that my mom will be away from all this suffering, torturing from my dad. I think Jacob is um, is like very competitive. Mr. World Singapore, you have to be best in everything in terms of your look, your body, 
um, also your personality. So I think it's more high, um, you can say on par with me a bit slightly higher. So he's the one that I'm going to really target on. The weakest, I just feel that could be Jeffrey. He don't have that enough confidence in him. I just think that I still think that I have very good chance to win. Between the other three, the more that I found less interesting as a And in terms of body, I think he's the weak, one of the weakest body. Like maybe one of the uh, biggest competitors like Mario. Yeah. Because uh, like he didn't have much preparation, but he just could just fit in so fast. And, uh, definitely, I I did up a lot of practice. I even uh, like yesterday, I stayed up until like uh, uh, one two a.m. just to actually practice like the interview questions. This is like now. <laughs> yeah, I always in my comfort zone, comfort zone. So I I I need uh, some people to ask me like. Yeah, you go and challenge this. You go and challenge this. Because I don't know actually how far I can go also. My name is Jacob and I'm 26 this year. I'm currently an entrepreneur and I really love music. I like to DJ and eventually want to create my own tracks. I also really like the ocean and if I combine them both together, my dream is to play music on a cruise for people I love.